What if I told you planting mangroves isn't as simple as putting a seed in the mud? These trees can store carbon like no other. But here's the twist. Most planted mangroves don't even survive. Before we dive in, don't forget to like and subscribe so more people know the hidden truth about mangroves. Mangroves are not just trees, they're protectors of life. Their tangled roots slow down waves, reduce erosion, and even shield coastlines from storm surges. They are also climate heroes, storing up to for times more carbon than tropical rainforests. And beneath their roots, fish, crabs, prawns, and even sharks find nurseries to grow. With so many benefits, you might ask if mangroves are this amazing, why don't we just plant them everywhere? Mangroves live in the toughest conditions, salty water, shifting tides, unstable soils. If planted in the wrong zone, seedlings drown at high tide or dry out under the scorching sun. Waves and floods. High waves and tidal floods are constant threats. Young seedlings with weak roots are easily uprooted or buried in mud. Nature doesn't wait for them to grow strong. Another challenge is pests like barnacles or tritip. They stick to young stems, weighing them down and stopping growth. And then there's marine trash, plastic bags, fishing nets, and floating debris that smother seedlings before they can breathe. Mangroves don't grow well on every coast. If the soil is too sandy, roots can't anchor. If it's too clay, oxygen can't flow. Only in the right balance of mud and nutrients can mangroves truly thrive. And let's not forget the pressure from humans. Many mangrove areas are converted into shrimp ponds, ports, or coastal housing. Replanting in these places becomes almost impossible if the land use keeps changing. Planting is only the first step without long-term maintenance. Most mangroves won't survive their first few years, but many planting sites are in remote, hard to reach areas, making regular care almost impossible. Have you ever joined a mangrove planting activity? Tell us in the comments. Did the seedlings survive or were they washed away? Your stories matter. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, so together we can spread the hidden story of mangroves to the world.